Hello, it's Peter here from Garden Goodness Smithfield and the Australian Worm Firm. And today we're unboxing a veggie bag. I've just purchased one for myself, so we thought why not set one up, given it's such a rainy day. We might as well get going. So, veggie bag is a kind of whipping bed. And as you can see in the picture, basically you have water in the bottom. Um, you have the uh, waterproof canvas special wicking mix in here and you can grow all kinds of different plants in here and I'm going to grow a chili in this one um, because it's going to keep the heat in so I'll be able to grow through winter despite the cold. So we'll open it up, pretty simple, there it is, so it's compressed down to a disc and it actually has these toggles so you can easily fold it up if you are not gardening for a period of time. You can actually use it and then you can pack it away if you need to. And it springs up like so. And it has special information about VeggiePod, which I won't read because we're in Australia. We just do stuff without reading instructions. And also, we had a VeggiePod workshop, so I got to see the instructions live. All right, come up and have a bit more of a look. So in the bottom, can you see the uh, plastic disc? And it's got the legs of the wicking bed sort of thing there. And then that's your opaque canvas. So I'm just gonna pour some of our special perlite, which is a medium perlite, um, into all the legs. Now, you can use more perlite than what I've used, but I'm just using this amount. And then I'll just cover the bottom surface with perlite as well and that's going to help us wick the moisture up to the chilli plant. Beautiful. All right, now I've used the BioGrow Premium Wicking Mix to fill this up. The Premium Wicking Mix is ideal for any sort of wicking bed, so whether it's a veggie pod, whether it's Adelaide Hills Veggie Gardens, whether it's a water ups wicking planter, any of those sorts of things, what it does is it contains special, um, some perlite, but more so your, um, your soil wetter, that sort of thing. Um, it does have about three months worth of fertilizer as well to get things started, so it'll be perfect for our chili plant. All right, let's open it up. They're 30 litre bags. I've used a couple, you could use up to three, or you could use more perlite than I have, but I'm only using a certain amount of soil depth, so I've gone with the two, two bags so one of those and you can zoom in you can actually see little bits of fertilizer in there just to feed the plant in the initial stage Beautiful, there's my second one. Now I will bed that down a bit because it needs to be well packed in to whip most successfully. And that's actually perfect amount because that's just come up to the edge of the area. So that's, that's all done. That was how simple it is to unbox and set up your veggie bag. You can close the lid in winter. So if I have my chili in there, I zip it up zips up super easily. If you want to harvest it, you can unzip it, of course, and you can compress it down and clip it. Compress it down so you can easily get to the um, food and so forth. It has little clips here to hold it in. So it's really versatile, really easy to work. And it's a really good price for a wicking bed. So this bag costs $99.95. And then the soil was $17 per bag and the perlite was $5. So the whole lot was around 100, just under $140 for the entire thing set up ready to put my chili plant in. So thank you very much for watching. And you can find these at both Garden Goodness Smithfield and also Garden Goodness Port Adelaide. Just look for veggie bag. And they're very easy to set up and go. And as I said, easy to pack away. Thank you very much for watching.